Hi, my name is Mark. I'm going to be doing this video walkthrough of a condo I just bought. I'm going to be renovating it. Um, hope you enjoy it. I'll try and uh, do some editing to make things uh, quick and easy to watch. Uh, this is my first time doing a walkthrough video like this, so bear with me. But uh, I'll try and walk through the uh, before pictures here and then uh, walk through some of the spaces uh, as they're renovated and uh, show you how things are done and um, hopefully some people can give me some good suggestions on uh, different ways to do things. I'm looking to do something interesting in here. I'm open to any ideas. I do all of the work 100% myself. Um, might have a couple buddies come by uh, here and there. But uh, anyway, enjoy. So this is what we're dealing with. Um, this little condo is 550 square feet. It is a two-story loft. It's got a pretty cool wooden spiral staircase. Takes you up to the second level. It's got a fireplace. This living area isn't very useful. I'll show you how we get around that. I'm going to replace pretty much everything you can see. Uh, all new appliances, countertops, um, everything in here. I'm going to replace the uh, cabinet doors and refinish the, the boxes. Uh, so it's going to look like a brand new kitchen. Rip out this bar. I'll build in a uh, custom little pantry cabinet area down there. Put in two inch forward blinds throughout. Uh, I don't really like a ceiling fan in here, so I'm going to design and custom build a nice chandelier for that space. Uh, fix up the fireplace. I might clad this uh, brick in uh, some nice tile, uh, some kind of mosaic maybe. Um, or I might just paint the brick if I get lazy with it. Got a nice view of the pool. HVAC is already in good shape. Um, washer and dryer hopefully are in good shape as well. Um, and the hot water heater is pretty old in there, but uh, seems to be working. That and these blinds right here on the sliding glass door are the only thing that are going to stay. Put new locks on today. This is the downstairs living area. Um, so this is what will serve functionally as the living room. Um, these uh, closet doors are going to be ripped out and uh, this whole space will be open. So that's kind of where you'll put your TV. I'm going to add a uh, electrical outlet down here uh, that's GFCI protected and then uh, I'll run that off of the one from the bathroom then I'll also run a uh, cable outlet here so that you can actually use that space here's the bathroom um, haven't decided if I'm gonna keep that tile yet it's in great shape but it's kinda ugly um, everything else is gonna be hundred percent gutted out of here uh, that little head knocker cabinet has to go makes this fa uh, space feel too small the entire uh, surround and bathtub is going to be ripped out, all new plumbing, everything's going to be redone. Uh, and then this area, I'm going to build uh, kind of some custom mirror, open shelving, nice unit in here. And I think for the vanity on this one, I might find a good deal on Craigslist. Um, but I'm kind of thinking I might just build a vanity from scratch and put uh, some real modern hanging off the wall. Cool little deal. Uh, so today I'm going to get started on the demo. Almost done with the walkthrough here. This is upstairs. The carpet is actually in pretty decent shape. This is going to be a rental property, so I'm considering covering to protect and keeping the carpet. I'm going to scrape all the popcorn ceilings off up here, so that might destroy the carpet. Hopefully this hasn't been painted. Popcorn ceilings, if they haven't been painted, they come off really easily, you just soak them with water. I'll show you that later. But I can see how this is just falling right off. Um, because it's so flaky, it'll absorb the water and it'll peel off smoothly and easy. Walls are in good shape, so I may skip out on a fresh coat of paint. Um, again, it's a rental unit, so it'll be painted again soon enough. Got a little bit of uh, storage in the closet. So any ideas to maximize this closet space other than what's going on now would be pretty sweet. Um, wasn't really going to do much there. And that's about it. So hope you enjoy watching me destroy this place and build it again. I'm going to rip out all the flooring today, all the appliances, the cabinet faces. Might get started on taking up that tile. And um, if it's a successful day, I'll gut the entire bathroom as well. Um, tearing up that fiberglass tub is going to be kind of tough. So anyway, I'll be in touch. Enjoy.